I think for me, St George's has been a real home uh, whilst I've been in Leeds. Uh, I moved up from the south coast about three and a half years ago now, and um, I think my whole time that I've been here, St George's has been a real place of rest and uh, peace, as well as um, fellowship and discipleship. And I think one of the key things that St George's does is in growing people. They really care about where people want to go and what people want to do. And I think for me personally, uh, that's looked like um, lots of opportunities to develop as a leader, whether that's um, through leading student small groups or youth small groups, um, as well as worship leading. And I think the time and the opportunities that St George's has given me have really helped uh, yeah, shape me as a leader. As I look back over our 30 years at St George's, I can see how it has carried on that tradition and invested in folk involved in a diverse range of church activities. Children and youth, students, interns, worship, events and hospitality, operations, curates and clergy, and a host of volunteers serving in many, many different ways. God has shown his faithfulness to St George's down many generations. In 2022, we can play our part in his ongoing work. As ordinary people, we have been equipped by God, provided with gifts, skills, talents and resources, each of which on their own may seem insignificant but together can be a catalyst to make extraordinary things happen. I started attending St. George's Church a couple months ago since late October, and I've been attending the International Student Bible Study Sessions held every Thursday evenings. I'm very grateful for the community I found there. I've made friends who are of the same faith, and I've also made friends who do not yet personally know Jesus, and I'm very happy to be a part of this journey with them, as I believe our paths have crossed for a reason. I've also recently started serving there with leading worship and also the small group discussions. I'm very thankful for these opportunities given, and I hope to be able to serve in other areas of the church as well. I love being at St George's because of worship. I love joining in and I love hearing everyone get into it and seeing them get into it. I've recently chosen St George's as my home church because I really appreciate the community it provides. Um, I've been at St George's for as long as I can remember and it's a wonderful welcoming atmosphere. I've always felt like a part of the family um, and yeah it's just a really great place to grow up in faith. Hi, I'm Chris Whitman and this is my husband Paul and we started worshipping at St George's quite recently. We've got three teenagers, our two older boys used to come to Roots and then Martha, our youngest who's 13, has been really involved in the youth work through Ellie Mae over the lockdown period. Um, she's really enjoyed that with her friends and we decided we wanted to come and worship at St George's as a family. What we really enjoy about worshipping at St George's is the music and the time of worship we have together and we're really looking forward to meeting more people over the coming months. Lizzie, do you like going to St George's Kids? Yes, it's fantastic. Do you? Yes, I like going to St George's Kids on Sundays. St George's to me is all about community. I really enjoy spending time with people. I enjoy uh, meeting for coffees, pub after church. I enjoy standing side by side with people and worshipping. Um, I love working with our under twos as part of Wrigglers and I love spending time with people who are so completely different from me and who I can learn so much from. It's such a joy to be part of that wider family. St George's means a lot to me. Having been away for about five years, when I returned last year, it felt as if I'd come back to my spiritual home. I've loved reconnecting with people, meeting new ones too. And I feel that God has given me all sorts of opportunities through the walking group, um, the choir, meeting the international students and, and prayer, so that I feel part of the church community and that I'm serving him.